Welcome to our tech troubleshooting video. Today, we're addressing a frustrating issue that many Ionic developers encounter. Our viewer Richard is facing an error that reads, module build failed. Errant, no such file or directory. Let's dive into the details. Richard's error occurs when he tries to instantiate a new rating model in his code. The error message indicates that the system can't find the specified file. Interestingly, he has checked his imports for case sensitivity, but everything seems to match. Let's explore this further. Upon further investigation, Richard noticed something peculiar in Visual Studio Code. There appear to be two files, ratingmodel.ts and ratingmodel.ts, but only one exists in the file system. This discrepancy could be the root of the problem. Let's see how we can help him resolve this. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your question answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to say just a little bit crazy, just like me, and work through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. You're encountering a runtime error in Ionic that states, module build failed, error in int, no such file or directory. This typically means that the application is trying to access a file that doesn't exist. In your case, the error points to the file ratingmodel.js in the path slash users Richard Moraes development slash ionic the who zoo slash pages slash model slash. This suggests that the application is looking for a JavaScript file that hasn't been generated from your TypeScript file. One common reason for this issue is case sensitivity in file names. Since you're using Mac OS, the file system is case insensitive by default. However, if your imports don't match the actual file name's case, it can lead to this error. To resolve this, ensure that your TypeScript files are being compiled correctly. You can try deleting the www or dist folder and then running the build command again. This will force Ionic to regenerate the necessary files. Finally, if the issue persists, check your IDE settings. Sometimes, Visual Studio Code may show cached results that can be misleading. Restarting the IDE or refreshing the project can help. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. The user discovered a bug in their code caused by importing an object with the wrong case. They found the issue and confirmed there was no actual problem. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. If you're encountering the error module build failed, error noent no such file or directory, it usually means your component isn't found in your app.module settings. Here's how to fix it. First, right-click on your web browser and select Inspect. Then, go to the Sources tab and navigate to localhost 8100, which is the default port for Ionic. Next, go to SRC and then Pages to open the corresponding page like Model. Make sure the .ts file name and path match the import path in app.module.ts. Check if the TS file exists. 
For example, if model's rating model TS is missing, that could be the issue. Remember, the path is case sensitive. And that's it guys. I hope we've gone through the question and found that solution you're looking for. And look, if we did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.